On June 1st, 2015, projects were stacking high and bright at the Physics Fest in the Citrus Handy Campus Center. The 120 or so physics students in classes 201 and 202 showcased and demonstrated semester-long group projects in how creative they could be. My students and Lucia Ritter, Ritter students um, turn into projects on the same day when we have lab and we were in different rooms and the students were so curious about each other's projects that we thought you know we need a way for them to interact and also a way to maybe see um, let the campus see what our students are doing. The Physics 201 class taught by Professor Lucia Ritter had to create an interactive game that taught physics and had no age or gender specification so everyone could play. In teams three or four, students use their time and money to put their projects together and for the materials needed. This also gave the students a chance to show their creative side through physics, which is a unique twist to typical research. To build the toys, which took all semester, and all the calculations and pre presentations. Um, we're going to make sure all the testing of our toy and make sure it can last all day here and um, be played with and enjoyed. <laughs> Alongside the fun and games, Gloria Ramos's Physics 202 class demonstrated their knowledge of circuitry through models with working lights. The students had to create a structure with multiple rooms that each had different lighting systems and were wired up to the accordion switches. These projects were no short of creativity either. The student structures ranged from the Eiffel Tower, a movie theater, and to Batman's lair. Well, it was just a lot of construction. The circuit part was pretty easy. It was just putting together the board, really. Um, probably most proud, we used the Arduino microcontroller to control the LCD, a UV light, and a buzzer. I focused mainly on programming the Arduino and setting up the circuits for that. I also helped with uh, wiring all the lights. The event ended after physics students, friends, family, and curious citrus students toured all the projects. Groups take their projects home, finish with the semester-long assignment, and prepare for the upcoming finals week. Today, the physics department showcased their intelligence, hard work, and creativity through their projects. Physics Fest not only included all physics students, but reached out to Citrus students to show them the interactive and interesting aspects of the department. I'm Mara Sullivan, reporting from Citrus College.